Look, uh, I, I have no idea what this guy did or what he didn't do. I don't know what's true and what's not anymore. And the fact that I'm saying that does not mean at all that I um, think Watson is a bad guy. Because I don't know people anymore, man. You don't know people anymore. We don't know people anymore. This world is so freaking crazy right now, and I think everybody feels it. It's spinning off its axis that somebody who looks like a dream come true, which Watson certainly looks like and still can possibly be. I have no idea. No idea. You know, he came into the league, looked like the dream come true. What, Michael Jordan in cleats? Is that what the phrase was from Dallas? Yeah, that's mm-hmm. what people were saying. And then he remember he gave his first paycheck to all the workers at uh, the Texans facility because, yep. of the, because of the hurricane. Mm-hmm. Spectacular. And then I have no idea why in the world anybody needs as many masseuses as he apparently employed. Nobody. I, honestly, none of it makes sense. I have no idea. Bottom line is a grand jury, though, on Friday that we were talking about on the show, grand jury on Friday in the state of Texas said there's no criminal activity here. So that's off the table. That's what it appears to be. Does it mean that he's innocent? It does not. It just means they did not have any evidence in front of them to hand in an indictment on a criminal behavior. So now teams that have been waiting to find out, is he going to be criminally liable for this? Have found out the answer is no. Certainly in that legal system, I don't know, is there a federal charge? Wasn't there some federal coming? I don't know if FBI was supposedly looking. There's just so much up in the air and now's the time to start making a maneuver. Apparently tomorrow he's taking, Tuesday he's taking depositions in the 20 plus civil suits that have been filed against him. You want to make an investment of draft capital that the Texans are talking about? You got to make some sort of Thelma and Louise hand grab and hit the gas pedal at this moment. Maybe a great bet, though, because if Watson is totally innocent and all of this has just been the worst perpetration of mass bogus lawsuits being filed against him, then it's not much of a risk. Then you're going to take somebody on, you'll deal with whatever PR hits are coming, and this will never happen again, and you might win championships with somebody who is so damn good. Or you'll find out something down the road. I don't know. Do you take that risk? Do you take that jump? That's the question. That's what's in front of all of these teams right now trying to do their due diligence. I know his agent said don't lo- media shouldn't lose the same intensity because he had no criminal conviction placed against him. But that's why I'm so I'm I'm telling you with the same intensity he has no criminal charges that have been fo- filed against him. But do you know anybody anywhere in, in this world anymore? Do you? And if you're an NFL team, do you take that jump? Looks like Carolina's going to. Looks like the Saints are going to. Who else? Because it's three first-rounders you got to cough up this year and then your next two. That is a huge haul. Huge. It's the great unknown right now. And the positive for a team is, is it could be the greatest unknown because what's real is that he is the guy that we all thought he was when he was drafted. And boy, what a jackpot that would be if you can get him at this age with a chip on his shoulder, ready to just come back and play football. I'm sure he is raring to go, raring to go. And I don't blame him for wanting to maybe meet with all the teams that want him. Might slow things up. Or the great unknown is you just don't know people anymore, man. And you're giving up all those draft choices for who knows what. Did you ever really know people, though? I guess. I mean. You, you could say that since the dawn of time, yeah, right? I mean, Adam and Eve or whatever. You, you know, Like yeah. you just don't know people. You can use your best judgment. You can, I'm just saying these days, I, I just, I don't know. You get lied to so many times and every single day you see on your Twitter feed people saying things that you know are completely false because you saw it with your own two damn eyes. (laughs) And it's just like in this day and age, it's just totally crazy right now. So um, it's just the greatest unknown right now. And and it could be very known and we'll find out which team's going to go. But it's time's clock's kind of ticking, kind of ticking since the new league year begins. 
Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.